Okay, one little <clears throat> piece of advice or thing that I found out or discovered here. If you're gonna do the micro bubble scrubbing method for different treatments and all, some people use it for different things. Some people just say it helps the overall health of the tank. Um, and some people use it to treat dinos that I've read. But if you do that and run a fleece roller filter, uh, the micro bubbles are actually enough to stop up the filter roll paper. So you can see them all stopped up right there. You can see how high the water level is there versus the float valve, which I had to turn it off because in two days time, it almost burned through a whole roll and it's not even dirty. So, I kept watching it and I was like, what in the world is going on? And I finally looked in there and uh, I saw the micro bubbles, the air bubbles building up on the filter paper. And it was just causing it to constantly roll. So just a quick tip if you decide to do that. So basically what I've done is uh, I had the air stone in front of the pump and basically I've just moved it to the back there. Um, dosing the bacteria that I am it says it can drop the oxygen level in the water so I left it going you know basically just for that so that I'm still putting some air in the water if that helps. I'm assuming it will but anyway I moved it out from the front of there. So now the only bubbles I have actually in the tank are larger ones coming from the UV sterilizer. And then just to update on that, you know, we did a three day blackout. And, uh, you know, I still see brown all over the sand bed and then in the sand there. Um, so it looks like we're gonna, you know, I don't think that helped anything. So it looks like we're gonna continue on with the treatment. But anyway, just a quick, uh, quick, quick update. Um, I don't know if the UV helps and it seems like when I ran it last time, you know, it didn't put a dent in it. So I don't know, I might, uh, might just take the, uh, couple mushrooms out there and the, uh, digitatas and then just start hitting it with a heavier dose of dino x but we'll see all right thanks for watching just like i said i wanted to uh kind of document video all of my experiences and you know i thought that was a kind of interesting deal uh, i was doing something else on the tank i was feeding them all and i kept hearing the uh, roller just turn slightly like every so many seconds and I look down here and uh, yeah, just notice, you know, I just changed out that roll uh, this past weekend. So it's already eaten through like half of it. And, uh, and I came down here and noticed that. So yeah, I saw all the micro bubbles like coming out in here and then they're all just stuck to the paper. All right, thanks for watching.